Okay, how y'all doing? This is Apostle Spurgeon, True Authority with True Life Fire Correction Deliverance Ministries. Just wanted to bring to you some more info on the Jezebel spirit and how it ties into the secret society. I just want to let you know that everything that we see today is not really real. You know, you can look at, you look all around, you see the signs and the symbolism everywhere. Uh, in the music industry, Jezebel is involved, which is Je the Jezebel spirit. Um, see, Jezebel did a lot of sacrifices. She did a lot of, that's what witches do, and Jezebel was the first witch. Well, no, Eve. Eve, because she rebelled against her husband and rebelled against God. She rebelled against both authorities. She wasn't subject to nobody no more. So her not being subject to authority caused her to do her own thing, which caused her to run out and be double-minded and no longer hearing the single-mindedness of her husband and went out and decided to destroy her marriage relationship by bringing another person into the marriage, a snake, which ended up... Uh, now see, the Bible says that she ate from she ate the fruit, but the Bible says also be fruitful and multiply. The Bible says the Bible don't say give birth to apples and fruit. No, the Bible says be fruitful and multiply. So the fruit of a woman's womb can be uh, fertile and also produce children by way of seed from a man who has who has seed to bring forth fruit. The Bible says that every seed must bring forth fruit of its kind. Okay, so when a man produces, when a man gives off seed to a woman, they end up intertwining and you know, our birth go. Now, the snake gave the seed to Eve when she left out the garden and disobeyed her husband, went wandering, became a busybody. She slept with the serpent and the serpent gave her children. First child was Cain, which is a murderer. The Bible says that every seed give forth uh, let every seed bring forth of his kind, bring forth fruit of his kind. So as Satan was, so as was the child. The devil brought forth the, the spirit of the child, which was the murderer, the murderer, the murdering spirit. Uh, a murder spirit is also connected to a homosexual spirit. A homosexual spirit does not produce fruit, does not, is not fruitful. It stops. Whenever it lands, it stops. It don't go no further. But it wants you to believe out of the mind of a strong delusion that that is actually fruitful. And really, it's not. Um, homosexuality has never been fruitful, can't be fruitful, ain't going to be fruitful. The Bible says in Romans chapter 1 that men um, burning their flesh after one another. That's the hour we in, Romans chapter 1. So in, in order for you to really understand that a murder spirit is really a homosexual spirit, most murderers are homosexuals because they can't produce life. They only take life or, or end it. Two penises cannot produce fruit. You just see, like I don't want to sound vulgar or out of character, you know what I'm saying? But it can get deep. But this is what all men that are not pure do. They just give off seed. And they can't produce nothing, they just give off seed because it's, it's pleasurable. It's pleasurable to give off seed. It's not pleasurable to God to be unfruitful. The devil likes to cut seed. The Lord likes to give seed and produce more of that which it is. That's why he said be, be fruitful and multiply. Multiply and replenish. The Bible also tells us that every seed shall give forth fruit of its kind. Apostle Darren McCoy said this. Everything that doesn't have a seed has been man tampered with. It's been taken into some type of scientific laboratory and altered all up to where it don't have a seed. He also said we like sun-kissed grapes, sun-kissed oranges, all that type of stuff. The first original fruit and vegetable had seeds in it. When man got his hands on it, he disrupted what God had already created. And anything that does not have the spirit of God is none of God's. Anybody that don't have the spirit of Christ is none of his. So whatever don't have the spirit of Christ has the spirit has the antichrist, and they decide to cut and start to push forth more fruit. That's all I want to say for that. Y'all be blessed. The True Life Fire Correction Deliverance Ministries. More on this topic of the Jezebel spirit.